IFF Fit Fun ladies, it's Katie, your FFF EIC, and I am here with our lovely lifestyle editor, Tasha. Hi. And we are here to do a fabulous uh, DIY that's perfect for springtime, just in time for Easter. Yes. What are we doing, Tasha? We are going to take metallic tattoos that come in your FabFitFun spring box, and we are going to apply them to our Easter eggs. Yeah, so they're going to look just like this. Why would you want a boring old Easter egg when you can have a super glam fancy Easter egg? Exactly. All right, so how do we do it? It's just like a regular tattoo, right? It's just like when you were five years old and you would get the tattoo from the little machine and you would put on your superwoman tattoo. And that's Superman, exactly- Superman, that was your, your go-to choice? Um, no, I was more of a My Little Pony girl. Gotcha. Um, but I was jamming the holograms, which ages me, but they're coming back, so I'm very excited about that. Yes. So, and it's the exact same process. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take our tattoo and there's a plastic lining on it, so we're gonna peel that back. We're going to pick our egg. I'm gonna take the silver one right here, and you've got the gold one. I have got the gold one. I will say, you can actually do it on a white, like a regular basic egg, but we actually went ahead and we spray painted um, some of ours with gold, silver, and pink, just to kind of give it a little bit more glam. And I will say, make sure to boil your eggs. Yes. You don't want like an egg explosion everywhere. everywhere. Not good. I will also say you should try to um, put the eggs in before the water starts boiling because it will help your eggs not crack. So little tip, insider tip. Right. So from there, we're just gonna place it right onto our egg wherever we want it. You're gonna notice it's a little bit sticky already, which makes it even easier. Right. And then we're gonna take our washcloth and we're gonna get it wet. And you wanna get it really wet, right? Because you yeah. want it to actually transfer over to To transfer the egg, through yeah. the paper, right. So then we're just gonna dab it right on there and you might need to add a little bit more water. And you just dab it all the way around making sure that you get to the edges as well. It's okay if you go over and you're actually just like dabbing the egg, it won't hurt it. And then you'll kind of feel that it starts to get a little bit slippery and this paper will probably just slide right off. Exactly. And that's when you know that it's ready. And then from there, I like to just get a little bit more water just a little bit and go over it one more time to seal the edges. And it'll also take out any wrinkles in right. case you messed up a little bit. And that's it. How cute is this guy? It's so you, easy. You want this in your Easter basket, right? Yes. Of course you do. Love. Everyone's going to be so jealous of your eggs. This is actually easier and I think cuter than just dipping them like the traditional way. So much cuter. You are going to win on Pinterest and Instagram. Thank you. Thanks to this tutorial. Yes. For sure. <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys for joining us. We had so much fun. Katie, would you say that this DIY is an excellent one? <laughs> I absolutely <laughs> would. All right, we'll see you later, guys. Thanks so much. Thank you. Bye.